penalties are necessary. As Huddersfield uh, just kick off this match, the first half. Ball going out wide. Oh, the goalkeeper just. Uh, oh, and there's a goal! Number seven. Literally seconds gone. Number seven, Chris Kelly. It's on the ball there. A little bit of skill, but Huddersfield have won the ball back with a little bit of pace moving right through the middle into a really promising foot on the edge of the penalty area. Huddersfield looks across it, and that oh. ball just got tipped off the bar. Two big lads there. They're going for it now. They're going straight in there now. Oh. A little bit of a melee in the Huddersfield centre penalty area, and that was uh, nearly deep trouble of Huddersfield there. It could have easily been 2 0. But um, they have been repelled temporarily at least. Yeah, Mewick there. Back. Sorry, Ross. Mewick there, the keeper, Huddersfield keeper. Now then, has it oh. come through now? If he's on side, it's a great opportunity to score and get the second for Fulham. As the ball is level with the Huddersfield penalty area. In fact, a lovely move from Fulham. Oh, and that was a good opportunity, slightly wasted, Jury. Selves looking to go to find somebody going forward, which they do. They find the man on the edge of the Hudders inside the Huddersfield penalty area. Oh, and that was a good effort. And, uh, and now it's back in midfield. Something like 30... Well, it's, oh, there's an effort there by Huddersfield. Only sought to find the Fulham defenders move the ball forward, although he's been dispossessed by a Huddersfield player again. Good position this and a really good ball for from Huddersfield. A great chance to score there, just such a shame. Looking to get that ball right into the penalty area, on the edge of the Fulham penalty area, pressing hard Huddersfield. And it's a good position, Huddersfield there. Oh, and that was that was George Danaher, the captain. Mind, uh, if they do get the equaliser, this game will go to extra time. And finally, if uh, the game's not settled, ball. the penalties. As Huddersfield have a really good opportunity here. Really nice cross, yeah. and that's a goal for Huddersfield Town. Obiera. By Obiera, the substitute, number 12. Yeah, I mean, it was an incisive ball through to Mason O'Malley, the fullback. He, he cut the ball, was split between two defenders. O'Malley ran onto it, got a lovely deep left foot cross, swinging away from the keeper, uh, a deep cross. And uh, there was Abiera, the substitute, to head it down and back across from the way it had come into the far corner. Yeah, they're probably ready for uh, their beds. Now then, right wing for Fulham. Fulham, Fulham good opportunity for the goal there, but... Um, Who am I to? Ryder Haviland say. will be taking this corner for Fulham. This Pretty good the... one. Oh! Oh, absolutely Ooh. cracking effort. Well, Fulham are taking the first penalty. He's in now and he places it nicely to... And now it's uh, number eight. And he's hit the post. <laughs> That's Scott High. Is it up? It's saved and it. it's been saved. So... By Luke Mewitt. Coming up with his right foot. And he saved. And he saved. Went to the keeper's left. See uh, Reese York. <coughs> and oh, it's now. hit the post. Yeah. Give out some what? <laughs> and he's uh, put out through the middle. Oh, and he's scored That's it pretty well. One. Excellent penalty. Dyson. Yeah. Strikes oh, that one home. A really well taken penalty into the far corner. Uh, seeks to strike the ball. And he does. And a, another really excellent penalty. He uh, hits it. And he, he hits, hits that one well. Kept his nerve. Yeah. Keeper taking this for... And he oh, scores it. Uh, right in the top corner. I have... Left foot. A left foot. Uh, down. It takes it. Missed oh, and it, it. saved it. it. It's uh, and that, Jordan Neal.